Uh, hi again. Um, firstly, can I apologise if you hear um, heavy rain? Um, it's pouring down in Kent at the moment. But uh, yeah, I wanted to show you this um, very quickly. Uh, th this will be a very quick video. Um, but I found something that's really, really cool. Um, a company called Layouts for You. Uh, I've started to sell um, this particular product and it's called let me just pick it up a latching reed switch um, some of you may know the conventional reed switches are either on always on or always off so uh, for example you are powering lights for example like an, an LED strip you can have always off so you connect the reed switch up to it and the lights would be off and when you introduce a magnet they create the, the switch closes, the contacts closes, power gets through and the lights come on. Or you can have them always on. So the lights will be on permanently. You introduce a magnet, opens the circuit, um, the, or closes the circuit, and the lights uh, go off. Uh, this one being a latched um, reed switch, you can either have them always on, and I'll just switch them on, like that, and it'll stay on and I can move the magnets away or I can just switch them off by putting magnets over them like that switch them on switch them off what they have and you may be able to see it is a small magnet just there and that magnet controls the the, the points um, so when you introduce the magnet it closes. Um, what you then do is you turn the magnet over, and it's depending on the pole um, that you're using on a particular magnet against the um, the reed switch. Um, so you use one side of the magnet to switch the lights on. You then turn it over, and use the opposite pole to switch them off. And I think it's absolutely brilliant. I can see real potential in these in coach lights um, they all they do work off um, those flat batteries um, that use three volts so you can get a flat battery holder with the battery in line in the circuit and uh, shove it all in your coach um, what you suggest you'd have to do is um, you'd have to do a row of LED strips because I think three volts with these balance resistors in them um, you won't get any light at all <laughs> um, so you'd have to have a string of LEDs um, that do not have resistors um, the good thing about having um, the LED strips in your uh, coach with the three volt battery is and you haven't got to worry about polarity so the coaches can be turned round um, so you haven't got to worry about positive or negative because um, you're not drawing power from the track uh, it's from the actual um, battery that will be inside the coach um, if you were on DCC um, or sorry if you were um, deciding to use contacts on the wheels um, what you'd have to put in line is a bridge rectifier. Um, the lights come on now, I've just come near that. Um, you'd have to use a bridge rectifier to control the polarity. Um, uh, and they're relatively cheap. Um, my only gripe, let's turn these off. My only gripe with these is the three pounds each, which I think is a bit expensive for a reed switch, although it's um, uh, the latching switch um, is, is far more beneficial than always on or always off reed switches. Um, if you go to layouts for you website and to this section where they're selling these, they have a link to a video um, of one of the employees um, fitting these, one of these into um, coach. Um, using this latching and it's absolutely brilliant 
I think it can be, there's many places on the layout I see that these, um, that, that these can be used. Um, instead of drawing power from a, a bus going round your layout um, and why it's gone through the board and so on, you can put these in the building with the reed switch and the roof, hidden obviously in the roof. And you can turn the lights on and off by simply doing that. Absolutely brilliant. Really am pleased with this. I'm going to get quite a few of these. And uh, I'm definitely going to use them in coaches. I'll probably use them in some buildings as well. Um, yeah, absolutely cool. Um, yeah, this was just a quick video to show you that because I really am, really am pleased with, uh, with what these re-switches do. So, thanks very much for your time. Bye for now.